we had around 50 and 70 fps and right now we have around 500 400 fps hey guys welcome to my new video i will show you the best t-launcher video settings for t-launcher 1.20 you may be wondering why i'm on the desktop well we have to make sure we do some changes before we launch the t-launcher so let's get to t-launcher please and we will change some settings in here before we start the rest so we are in the t-launcher as you can see 1.20 version and let's get to the settings we need to uh, adjust the memory application to our pc so if you have 16 gigabytes of ram like i do type in 8000 mb okay if you have 4 gigabytes of ram use 2000 f and if you have 8 gigabytes of ram use 4000 you need to make sure you always have 50 percent of your ram capacity you need to make sure it's only 50 percent not 60 or 40 50 percent is the best for you and this will give you additional fps so hit save and just uh, log into your t launcher account uh, make sure you have the one dot fanny version and hit enter and yes i have the pre-release uh, of the 120 uh, but it doesn't really matter because this will work on 120 without any issues so as soon as you are watching this video you are using 1.20 but it is completely fine so we are in the menu and go to the single player piece and uh, choose your word okay we don't have to create a new word just cre uh, create your word not create a <laughs> play sorry and as you can see i have around 70 50 fps okay it's, it's, it's flashing but never mind uh, let's get to the options and let's adjust these settings to make much more fps okay so follow my steps biome blend we don't need it so you can turn it off as you can see it also says that uh, is the fastest way uh, graphics uh, you can turn that on the the fast because you don't have to have fast uh, fancy graphics sorry uh, just in case if you have a high-end pc you you won't be watching this video so this is for low-end or medium-end pc okay so the chunk builder let's get it to semi-blocking that's the best for me you can try fully blocking and thread it but the semi-blocking is the best for me uh, render distance and simulation distance the best for me is 10 and 8 i believe it will work great for you i even tried this on my low-end laptop uh, it had uh, like i don't know around 200 fps and the laptop has uh, get takes uh, 1050 i believe i'm not sure now but uh, it worked really good so uh, turn off the smooth lighting and v-sync okay we don't need it and uh, the brightness let's get it bright so 100 and mip up levels to zero so off yeah you don't need that uh, right now uh, let me show you what the view bobbing is okay so if we turn this off uh, check you the uh, animation yeah it, it's it's not bobbing it, it's weird it looks really really weird and when i turn it on yeah check the animation now it's much more better and it it doesn't take a lot of fps so even if you have a low-end pc i would recommend to leave this on uh, clouds turn on clouds of course and particles to minimal and that's practically everything yeah and we have around we had around 50 and 70 fps and right now we have around 500 400 fps which is really good yeah so thank you so much guys for watching this video and see you next time